So, you know, there are moments where you don't want to lay all your cards out on the table, right? You want to either create a little bit of mystery so that people don't know what you're going to do next and they're wondering what you're going to do next. And as they're wondering what you're going to do next, they're kind of on their heels a little bit. What's the next thing that, that, that Stephen is planning? I don't really know. Wow. You know, it makes, it, it's a very powerful approach. There are other times and other experiences and moments in life where you do want to reveal what you're planning to do because there's a purpose behind it. I'm just saying, be aware. Don't just act in this world. Be aware. Have a strategic mindset. Sometimes concealing is what you need to do. Sometimes not concealing is what you need to do. It's funny when we have this conversation about power and the darkness and the shadows that people have in them. I think a lot of people listening and probably it seems that way because I'm the one asking the questions is if I'm questioning society that I'm not part of, um, they'll think they don't, they might think they don't play these games, right? They might, you know, so that's the question I have is like, have you ever encountered anybody? Do you believe there's anybody out there that doesn't play power games, manipulation, have shadows, have darkness in them? No, I don't. 